You ever wonder why you might have three signal bars but you can't load a web page? Or maybe you have two bars and your friend with a different phone on the same carrier has four bars? Well, here's how to use a hidden app on your iPhone called Field Test to see your true signal strength. Because you can't trust the bars. The bars are bullshit. The signal bars on your phone are mostly just arbitrary. Yeah, more bars should equal a stronger signal, but there are no standards for how strong or clear of a signal equals how many bars. Phone makers get to just make up how many bars they want to show you, and it even changes from one model to the next or even through software updates. What you really want to see is your true signal strength, represented in decibels. And there's a hidden service app on your iPhone called Field Test that can show it to you. It's not exactly convenient, but it is interesting. And here's how to access it. First, use the control center or the settings menu to turn off Wi-Fi. Then, open the phone app and enter the following numbers and symbols exactly like this. Star 3001 pound 12345 pound star. Then press the call button and the field test app should open up. There's a lot of stuff in here and it is not clearly labeled. After all, this is a service menu and not made for regular users. To find your signal strength, tap on the LTE menu. Then select Serving Cell Measure. This will take you to a page full of data, and every few seconds it'll keep changing, so it's a little hard to follow. You're looking for the line RCRP0. It stands for Reference Signal Received Power. The number is in decibels and ranges from around negative 40 to negative 140. Higher numbers, stronger signal, so negative 55 is a super strong signal, and negative 125 is a very weak signal. You might also look at the RSRQ0 line, which is reference signal received quality and takes into consideration interference. A good value for this is negative 5 to negative 10. A bad number is negative 15 or lower. If you see a line for RCRP1, that's the next nearest tower which you might also be connected to. To get out of the field test app, just close it as you would any other app. Now obviously you're not gonna use this often, but it's an interesting and much more accurate way to get a look at your signal strength and quality.